What you are looking at may appear to be normal. It's something you've likely seen several times. These are trucks transporting live animals like cows, pigs, and chickens. They drive our roads every day. But what do we know about them outside of the moments we pass them on the highway? If you take a closer look, you will find a story many don't know. Stressed animals, overcrowded, beaten, hungry, and thirsty. They travel long hours in extreme heat and intense cold. But who are these animals? Where do they come from? And where are they going? After a life of cruelty on a farm, animals used for human consumption end up at a slaughterhouse. But first, they are forced to endure a brutal journey from farm to slaughter. Animal equality investigators in Mexico followed this journey to show just how inhumane live transport can be. Mexico transports millions of live animals every year. Their safety and comfort is supposed to be guaranteed by the Mexican official standard, which sets standards to reduce the suffering and stress of animals used for food. However, what actually happens during the transport of millions of cows, pigs, chickens, and other animals completely violates the protections put in place by authorities. As they are prepared for shipment, workers force animals to move by hitting and yelling. Some workers use metal objects to hit animals. Some are hit violently in the head. Injuries during loading and transport are common. The truck floors are dirty and slippery. Many animals slip and fall on their own feces during the journey. The vehicles are overcrowded, and animals step on each other's feet. They bite the bars of the truck and scream. They are stressed and scared in the overloaded trucks. Their journey continues amid excessive noise, sudden movements, hunger, thirst. This causes tension, stress, fatigue, and injuries. The trucks also do not have a roof to protect the animals from the sun, rain, or hail. The inadequate design also means there is no ventilation, and the animals suffocate. How long are animals forced to endure these conditions during transport? In Mexico, routes go from one end of the country to the other. They are long-distance trips, and many animals die before even reaching the slaughterhouse. When it is time to unload from the vehicles, workers kick injured and tired animals out. There's not a ramp to climb down, so even injured animals are forced to jump down, hurting themselves again. From the moment they are transported until the moment they arrive, the animals are under immense stress. This cruelty is happening around the world as nearly 160 million pigs, lambs, cows, and other animals are transported to slaughterhouses every day. In the United States, animals are granted only one protection during transport. Trucks are required to stop every 28 hours to relieve the animals but this regulation is rarely enforced. Nearly 5 million chickens, cows, and pigs arrive dead to the slaughterhouse due to the extreme conditions during transport. What is the reason for this cruel journey, full of discomfort and suffering? The consumption of meat, dairy, and other animal products. We know animals feel and avoid pain. They want to live. The way the meat industry raises, transports and kills these animals, prioritizes profits over lives. These living, breathing animals are simply seen as a product, forgetting that they are individuals with emotions of their own. Choose compassion, and go vegan for the animals today. You can eliminate this suffering from your diet by leaving animals off your plate.